For the CH2S Lewis structure, we have a total of 12 valence electrons. Hydrogen atoms always go on the outside of Lewis structures. Carbon's the least electronegative. We'll put that at the center. So we'll put the carbon here. We'll put the hydrogens. Let's put them on either side. And we'll put the sulfur right on top. We have a total of 12 valence electrons for the CH2S Lewis structure. We'll put two between atoms to form chemical bonds. We've used six. Then we'll go around the sulfur, 8, 10, and 12. So we've used all 12 valence electrons for the CH2S Lewis structure. The hydrogens, they each have two valence electrons. Their outer shells are full. The sulfur has eight, so it has an octet. And the carbon only has six valence electrons. So we're going to need to fix that. It does not have a full outer shell or octet. Let's move two valence electrons from the sulfur here and share them between the carbon and the sulfur atoms to form a double bond. Now the sulfur still has eight valence electrons, but the carbon also has eight valence electrons. And we're using the 12 valence electrons that we have for this Lewis structure. So that's it. That's the Lewis structure for CH2S. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.